hi guys so this is a beginner's guide on how to make these sweet soft looking shawarma wraps at home right so let's get right into it to do this the ingredients we need are all-purpose flour sugar some yeast and then water that's just it that's just all the ingredients we need so we start by activating our yeast so we'll add the sugar to the yeast and then add some water to it. Mix it together, add water and let it sit for about 10 minutes. Okay, just add water, mix the sugar and yeast together and add water and let it sit about 10 minutes. So after 10 minutes, this is what our activated yeast is looking like. So you pour this into the all-purpose flour and then start kneading together. If you need to add more water, add, but make sure it's not too soft. Just add enough water for it to be able to knead well. So you keep kneading until you have this kind of consistency. Okay, and at this point you can add some oil, just a little bit of oil to it so that it makes the kneading easier. Keep on kneading until your dough is like all mixed in properly and looking very good. So you put some oil in the bowl and put the kneaded dough back into it and cover it with a kitchen napkin and let it sit for about 10 to 15 minutes. After this time, the dough probably doubles in size and then you knead it a little bit again and then cut into smaller portions, smaller balls like this and then set aside and cover again for about five to 10 minutes. After which you start rolling the dough out. The dough should be soft and not sticky. It should just be like perfect. Like the mixture should be perfect so that you can roll it out properly. So when you get about this thickness, look at the thickness of the dough. Yeah. So you heat a non-stick frying pan for about 10 minutes. Then you start heating up your dough. So you cook each side for about one minute. After this side is cooked, you flip over the other side and cook for about another minute. It's as simple as that. The shawarma wraps are done. So the wraps are ready now. See how easy it is to fold it because it's soft, right? So make sure your wraps are soft. So you can stack these together and cover with a cling film keep in the fridge or freezer thanks for watching guys